everybody hope your day is going well we are back with another reaction i'm looking forward to this one depeche mode policy of truth and this is a live version a request by alan thank you so much for this request and donation this is a band that i want to explore they have been on my list and i'm glad that we're finally starting with the policy of truth you know depeche mode of course i know them by name very famous and iconic i think i know the song uh enjoy the silence hey 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 but maybe i do need to revisit it with the reactor hat on and try to pay attention to all elements instead of just you know i know it from you know when it's on the radio and stuff uh so yeah it, you sometimes you rediscover a song or really discover the meaning of a song that i thought i knew uh, so that's very interesting. So maybe I will check out Enjoy the Silence on the channel. But let's start with uh, with Policy of Truth. that a lot you know they 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 have this you know electronic music mixed in with with other instruments and the the stage or a lot of the instruments seems like it's encased in almost like a spaceship type of vibe almost you know if maybe i'm mistaken but it looks like spaceship type stuff uh i love that and they're this song and and you know when i think of the melody of enjoy the silence they have a sort of seductiveness to their music in my you know you know, in my experience, how I experienced that, and also the the stage presence of the lead singer, I, I'm not familiar with his name yet, um, is, is also that, you know, some people, they really come alive on stage, you know, when you see them. Uh, it's so captivating. I'm thinking of, what's his name? Uh, Michael, I forgot his last name, I think, from NXS. He has that also that seductiveness to him. And he, you just look at these people and you're just in, entranced by how they move on stage and how comfortable they are on that stage, man. It's uh, That's something else right there. And the policy of truth. You decided in your youth. And that's a great line. And look where it, where it got you, basically. Sometimes, you know, brutal honesty. We need it from time to time. Sometimes we need to withhold it, you know, to protect other people or to protect ourselves and uh oh oh that's a different you know you know honesty you have that song and honesty is is it and truth is very important but sometimes 
you need to withhold it or, or even lie to know when that is the question hmm. you know there's a lot of places where you can say like the workplace for example <laughs> yeah we might need we might need to uh, you know sometimes withhold or lie something you know about something there uh not share every thought i realize the irony of saying that while i'm recording a reaction video where i disclose a lot of my thoughts <laughs> Hey, there's other stuff up here that you don't want to know. <laughs> yo, that's great. Hey, I love that concept, yo. It's it's very thought provoking, uh, and we all face that dilemma sometimes. Ooh, should we say this or not? You know, in relationships, maybe past mistakes. Sometimes, let bygones be bygones. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Hey, come on, that's amazing. Look at that, man. Wow, hey. That's a moose. Oh, yeah, you're standing there sometime. You better learn your lesson well. Or hide what you have to hide. And tell what you have to tell. That's a great performance. Oh! Thank you very much. I saw that design uh, reach out and touch me. Is that a line from uh, from Enjoy the Sun? Reach out and touch me. Yeah, yeah. I might be tripping here. Let, I want to look up the name of this man, yo, because he has a commanding voice. Dave Gahn. How do you pronounce that? Dang. New Wave. All right. Yeah, New Wave. That's the, that's the genre. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, man. Uh, he has such a commanding voice. It's like, it's, it's warm. It, there's power in it. Uh, and there's seductiveness in, in the way he moved on stage, like that twirling. Uh, yo, if I do that, I fall over. I fall over. Yeah. <laughs> I would be like, Woo where is the audience? <laughs> yeah, no, really great. I, I'm glad that I saw this live performance. 
I definitely want to hear more of their music. Very interesting. I love the drumming in this one too. And of course the electric, uh, electronic music, you know, I love that type. You know, I used to go to raves all the time. So I really enjoy when, when it's done well together, you know, this is a different type of electronic music, of course, but I love that type of sound. New wave in Belgium. We had, uh, it's, that's very famous. It's new beat, I believe, uh, it's called. So that is, that was very famous here. I think I made it pretty big around the world. So I really enjoy that type of music as well. Uh, when you bring that new and traditional, uh, together in a, in a, in a great way. And the lyrics are very thought provoking. Uh, and there's dilemmas in there that we have all faced and deciding on the policy of truth is a good thing, but you know, it's not all black and white, I guess. Uh, you know, there's shades of gray in between maybe 50. So yeah, that's a tough one. That's a tough one. Hmm. I think we can never really figure it out when we get the balance right or not, really. So, uh, uh, I don't think there's a right or wrong answer here. Uh, yeah, man, Depeche Mode. All right, this is my first one, but definitely not my last one. Thank you, Alan, once again. I appreciate you and every one of you for tuning in. Uh, hope to see you in the next one. Have a great day. Goodbye.